Hello, it is time for Science and Sensory. It is Thursday. We had our uh, Halloween celebration. We ate the, the mini pizzas that we made, the ghost pizzas. We had some mummy um, wrapped hot dogs and um, then we also uh, played around with some sensory stuff. This is kind of a science, but I, I'm going to call it sensory because honestly, outside of bubbles, I'm not sure what it, the science is involved and I wouldn't be able to explain it. So this is more of a sensory thing. Um, all you need is a cup, a disposable cup, um, and you need a marker. So these are, are going to be our ghost bubbles. You can make a ghost on your cup. Then you put a little bit of water. You can see that there's some water in it. And then we're just going to use some uh, uncolored Dawn. This doesn't have any fragrance or uh, dyes. And you can see that apparently I've decided to make more bubbles already. So we're going to put a little bit of um, dish soap. You don't have to use Dawn. You can use any dish soap. Um, this is an activity that I know that my children have engaged in. I've done it. It's a lot of fun. It's very easy. This is stuff that you should theoretically have in your home. Uh, if you don't want to put the ghost on it, you don't have to put the ghost on it. It doesn't have to be Halloween. But um, you do have to take your mask off. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take my mask off. I want you to know there is nobody else in the classroom. I am being safe. If somebody walks in, I will put my mask back on because I want everybody around me to be safe. So I put some dish soap in my water and I'm going to just blow. Now make sure that you don't suck because this is not going to, you're not going to drink this. This is not drinkable. Um, it's not going to taste good either. So, but we are going to, to blow into the water. We're going to blow bubbles. Our ghost has lots of bubbles. Actually, he, our ghost looks a little bit like, um, maybe a little bit like Marge Simpson. So that, that's all there is to this, this uh, sensory activity. You can do this as often as you like. It will continue. You can break down the bubbles with the straw. You can touch them with your hands and break them down. See the oils in your fingers the natural oils in your skin will pop the bubbles and then we'll make some more. More bubbles. That's all we have for that particular activity. I'm going to do another um, activity with not so much bubbles but with air but with ghosts. Apparently I like ghosts. So we're gonna, I'll, I'm gonna get that activity ready and I'll post another video in just a moment. Bye.